Nurses at Port Antonio Hospital in Portland staged a protest this morning, saying they fear for their safety. This following an incident this week where a relative of a patient who died at the hospital allegedly attacked a senior nurse. As TVJ Shamela Pullen now reports, the incident is now the focus of an investigation by the hospital's management. For four hours, nurses at the Port Antonio Hospital stayed off the job, demanding more security at the facility. Earlier this week, a senior nurse was allegedly attacked by the daughter of a patient who died. The nurses refused to comment on what led to the incident. They, however, complained that too often they are attacked by the relatives of patients. We are working in fear daily. We are verbally abused. But we can work with that somewhat. But the physical abuse, that is where we need to take a stand. We are nurses, we are porters, we are PCAs, we are records personnel, and we are human beings. And we need respect. We need proper fencing. We need pro more effective security measures. Yes, we have security guards, but there needs to be more effective security measures in place to protect us as staff. The woman at the heart of the controversy, Shireen Budal, says the hospital refused to hand over relevant documents so her father could be transferred to another health facility. Ms. Budal says her father was in a critical state, was not responding to the treatment given, and so after consultation with another hospital, the family was told that to facilitate a transfer, they needed a copy of his records. At that point, I got very upset and I start, I picked up his chart. She had the chart in front of her. I picked up the chart and I'm s slamming it onto the desk and said, I need a copy of my father's record. I need a copy of my father's record. She actually had me arrested for that. She had me arrested because I could not understand why I cannot get a copy of my father's record. Ms. Budal says she was told by a senior nurse that the family would have to wait five days for the documents to be prepared to facilitate her father's release. But during the wait, her father died. He passed. We went inside. We saw him laying there. I asked the nurse, Did my, is my father dead? Is my father dead? They wouldn't answer. I said, is my father dead? I don't know. Ask the doctor. I said, where is the doctor? I don't know. This is the response I got after my father passed away. When TVJ News contacted the management at the Port Antonio Hospital, they confirmed the incident, stating that an investigation is currently underway. Shamela Pullen, TVJ News.